Hey guys, good morning. Today I am going to be filming my summer morning routine. I'm just gonna film this vlog style and just take you throughout my morning. Now that I've been done with school and teaching for about a week now, um, I have kind of gotten into a little routine that's pretty relaxing and just getting stuff done. So it's a little bit after 8.30 right now. Warren leaves for work at 8.30 and so usually when he leaves, I wake up. Um, and so I'm just gonna take you through our morning. If you guys like this video, make sure to give it a thumbs up. Make sure to hit that subscribe button down below. I am a first year kindergarten teacher. I'm starting this fall and I'm super excited to take you guys along on that journey. And so yeah, so let's get into the morning. So usually right when I wake up, I usually make the bed right away just so that it's clean and picked up. And so I'm gonna show you guys that. Okay, and then once I finish making the bed, I will usually get um, a big glass of water and I'll fill this up either with lemon water or normal water. Today, I think we're out of lemon, so I'm just gonna do normal water and then I will get ready. Okay, and then the first thing that I do when I get ready is wash my face and then this is the face wash I use. I've talked about this before. It's just the Paula's Choice Clear Pore Normalizing Cleanser. It's super gentle but gets your skin clean, so. Now that my makeup is done, I just put a little bit of concealer on and then I put some mascara on and brush my tangled mess of a hair. Um, I will get dressed and then I will, I don't really like to eat right away. I kind of like to do something in between like finishing um, this water and eating breakfast. And so I usually will do some sort of like tidying up. I'm like kind of a clean freak, fun fact. And so I'll usually spend this little period of time just cleaning up. And so I think there are some dishes that I need to do. And then um, I'm going to put in a load of laundry. And so I'll just take you along through that. Okay, so I thought I would just show you a little outfit of the day. Super casual. Um, and so I'm just wearing this big cardigan. It is from Target. It's the a new day brand, I believe, or the Universal Thread brand. I can't remember. But and then I'm just wearing this pink crop top. This is from Zara. And then I'm just wearing some black leggings. So super casual day. Also summer in the Pacific Northwest. Cardigans. <laughs> About to leave. Already packing. Come with me. I'm not really asking, we'll get away to a place where we don't know. About to see the world in action, what we can be, life with no distractions. We'll get away, this is what we waited for. Okay, so now that I can feel relaxed because the apartment is clean, I'm going to make some breakfast. I usually really like to have a smoothie and some eggs for breakfast, and so that's probably what I'm going to do, not going to lie. <laughs> we usually try to clean up the apartment before we go to bed, but sometimes it just doesn't happen, and tonight was, or last night was one of those nights, it just didn't happen. So that's why I usually take the time to make sure that the apartment is clean so that I can relax during the day. So I'm gonna make some breakfast. Okay, so this is what I'm going to put into my smoothie today. So I always put chia seeds. I just have a thing of chia seeds here. 
I recently just found this at Trader Joe's. It's this organic maca powder, and it's supposed to be good for your health, uh, for your health, obviously, but for your energy levels and your hormones and um, anxiety. And so, I have some of that. I have some frozen pineapple tidbits from Trader Joe's, and then um, this Trader Joe's unsweetened organic acai puree packet. Um, I this is my first time trying it. I tried it for the first time. Um, a few days ago and I really like it and so I'm gonna have another acai packet and then I just have some strawberries that we need to use up some frozen banana and some almond milk so all of this will go into my Nutribullet and I'll blend it up and it will be my smoothie Okay, so I just finished making my breakfast, so I just have this smoothie, as you guys saw, and then I just scrambled two eggs with sea salt, pepper, and everything but the bagel seasoning. And I'm gonna read this book. It's by John Green. It's called An Abundance of Catherines. I'm like three-fourths of the way done, probably. I'm like right here, so I have like this much left. Something that I've been incorporating into my morning routine <clears throat> that I would highly, highly suggest and have honestly seen a really big difference is incorporating some sort of like quiet time. Hopefully you guys can't hear the laundry machine. It's kind of loud. Um, instead of going on my phone while I'm eating breakfast or instead of watching TV or Netflix or whatever, I have been really intentional about journaling or reading a book and so it's honestly been so relaxing and so just nice I haven't read a book for fun in ages just because of college and stuff and so now that I'm finally done and I'm on summer break and I have so much free time there's no excuse and so I've just been really trying to be intentional with my time, especially in the morning, to just set up my day to be really good. And so I would definitely recommend if you guys are on break as well, instead of watching TV or going on your phone, try reading a book, journaling, doing something more reflective and quiet and can kind of set your mindset up to reflect that for the rest of your day. So I'm gonna eat my breakfast and read my book and I will check in with you guys soon. So now that I have finished reading and stuff for the morning, I'm going to make a coffee. And so I think I'm going to make a drip coffee this morning. We also have an espresso machine and then we also have cold brew from Trader Joe's because we're obsessed with coffee basically. Um, I'm just going to make a simple drip coffee um, for my Keurig and add some almond milk and that will be my coffee.
for my morning. It's super low-key, just relaxing, getting some things done. And then usually after I finish like reading or whatever, I'll usually like work on a YouTube video or I'll go for a walk or I'll go run errands, whatever I need to do that day. So I hope you guys enjoyed watching. If you did, please give it a thumbs up. Make sure to hit that subscribe button so you won't miss any of my videos on my channel. And I hope you guys have an amazing week and I'll see you guys next time. Bye!